Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E. He the reason you see me. If y'all think I'm going to just sit right here, watch these people try to try to get strikes so off, killing my bubble without me clowning these douchebags. Y'all got me f***ed up. It just ain't going to happen. I'm an emotional wreck right now, and anytime I see lame shit, I just speak on it. I don't be giving a f what nobody got to say. Y'all telling me my boy done got killed for $800? A real Do y'all know him motherfucking kids got to see this shit for the rest of their motherfucking life? Nah, y'all got me f***ed up, and I don't be really listening to people. I don't be caring about what no motherfucking body got to say, because at the end of the day, no gonna pay your bills nobody ain't gonna send you shit while you down and you need them and then the motherfucker you look out for when they need you they cross you and cut you out and all this shit. so really opinions that shit don't really be meaning much to me unless it's just a real silent trying to talk to me and that shit is rare so you know y'all can get your i hate rollo tribe together and keep going on and on and i don't give a fuck about none of that I love Dolph. He want him looked out for my family while I was f***ed up, and that's just what I'm on, man. I don't, I don't like seeing nothing against them. They on my soul. I just get mad. I just get mad. I get mad. I don't know. I don't know how to control that s***. Y'all think I, got, I don't got no self-control when it comes to that shit. I just don't. I don't know how I'm going to get it. So y'all just got to understand that shit and just live with that shit. But that's what it is. Yeah, artist, yeah, 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 yeah. you know, like I said, it's better than the game. It's just, hey, yeah. Yeah. I see this come up. I swear, like, I see this come up. Yeah. How you yeah. feeling, good? Yeah. I appreciate you, too. Every time, man. Every time, I need that boost, man. Yeah. You know, I need you. They ain't good. Yo, yo, yo. Hey, man. It's the Boss Talk 101 ECO, man. Make sure you guys like, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys tap in. Uh, with Boss Talk 101, man, I really wanted to step back in here and talk about Boosie and Rollo and Yo Gotti just for one second. Um, so Rollo uh, pretty much has spoken out, said what he had to say since he came home from prison. He said, you know, he'll never do nothing with CMG because of the young Dolph killing. He said this before the trial. This is what he's been standing on ever since he came home. He's showing forth he's a Muslim and that he basically stand with uh, Dolph. Uh, that's been the two things, that, and he's rapping again. Those are the three things that you know that he's standing on since he came home. Well, you know, he's been saying what he's been saying. Now this trial started, it ignited a flame. He had already been going back and forth uh, about Boosie and some early dealings they had about Boosie calling him a snitch while he was locked up. So he had already been going at Boosie a little bit, but then you see Boosie pop out here lately and basically hanging out with Yo Gotti saying that, hey man, this dude, you know, uh, really, you know, I remember when he first started. So it's been crazy how, you know, these guys have been pretty much all this stuff is just pretty much everybody's you know boosie's over here hanging out with Gotti, so to speak uh rollo is saying i'm standing on business when it come to Dolph. his kids got to see that he was killed for eight hundred dollars uh how this trial played out they got to look at this the rest of their life Dolph looked out for me when i was locked up and then you know he ended up getting killed of course while he was locked up but he can't forget the fact and he said it just stirs him rubs him the wrong way every time he pretty much see or hear about this situation. Now, Boosie on the other end says the same thing and on retrospect that Gotti looked out for his family, his mom, when he was locked up. So it's a bunch of back and forth, man. And like I said, I've talked about it a little bit yesterday. Um, I'm on it again today, but today I got company, man. My guy, OG Pyru Ayatollah Marv is in the building, man. What's going on? Hey, 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 yeah, this is a mess. This is a mess. It's a mess, man. Like as life as as life has it, you know, it all comes to play. This things you say, you know, in the past are coming to eat you in the ass in in the present. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just it tripped me out because OG, you know, to see both of these guys, you know, lives have have, have been lost. Juke gone, uh 
uh, Dolph is gone. These two boys, like I said, uh, Rollo was locked up. You know, he didn't know. He was locked up and, and looked like Dolph was looking out for him. And then all of a sudden, boom, Dolph get killed while he locked up. But Dolph had been looking out for him evidently when he was locked up because that's what he's saying. Like, this dude was looking out for me. I could never come out here and disrespect, you know, who he was and what he represented to me. You know what I mean? While I was gone on my bed. And then again, Boosie said when I was gone, God was looking out for my mama. So what what we got going on here? So, I mean, I, still, still and all, you got to stand on your principle. And very, as we see in these trials, there's really no loyalties, you know, and, and the loyalties go out the window. But at least uh, brother is standing on, well, hey, I, I don't care how much money they got. This is what Dolph did for me. And I'm standing on it. I'm standing on my principles. But then you got the same, by the same token, Bootsy uh, says that, that, that uh, uh, Bruh got with his mother while he was locked up. Yeah, God, he got with his mother, but Rollo Fam Goon is saying that Dolph pretty much looked out for him. So it's a crazy situation. And, but Bo Bootsy, in turn, as we understand, he got on, 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 on Rollo's head and prematurely called him a rat. Correct, know? correct. So he's been going at him about that. He turns around in the same in the same circumstances. He's putting himself, and I, I met Boosie. He's a real nice guy. I met him in North Carolina. And he's a, you know, wherever he goes to his concerts, he brings his family. He's a family man. But still and all, the trash that you laid down a long time ago comes up to, to meet you. Yeah, you know? yeah, so, yeah. I, I, I see. That's why they say loose slips sink ships. So you got to be careful what you say about people and uh, to people because at the least amount of time it can haunt you. Now you got you got to deal with Rollo because you just said some ignorant shit. But now you got a case. Now why this? Rollo end up saying some after he seen Gotti and, and Boosie link up. Here, here you go. Watch this. Did all this old dapping and hugging that Everybody just seen him up the trial and seen that this man resurface footage of him getting shot. But he want to go over there, do all this. Hey, I see that with all that. So Rollo is upset because he say, you know, Boosie, you know that they just had this trial. You over here want to dap, dap this man up. You ain't got it dapping up after they resurface all this, all this stuff. You won't even let the family grieve. Basically, he feels a way because they came out right after all of this and start dapping up, and you know, basically, um, you know, they, he felt like it was just too soon. But Boosie came out, and you know, he said, he, I guess he just linked up with Gotti. I hadn't seen Gotti in a minute, so for him to pop out like this, it threw me off. But he, when he popped out, he popped out with Boosie, and he say, Hey, you know what I'm saying? I, I remember when you started, and and it's like that. But let's be real for a minute, man. This is a high intensity situation where lives have been lost, bro. And these, I mean, Gotti lost his brother. Uh, Rollo lost a brother in his own high side when it come down to Adolph. So it's crazy, man. OG, so when you think about this whole situation, OG, like, is Boosie wrong for what he's doing? Or is anybody wrong? Or is it just this way this thing falling apart? I, I mean, I, don't, I can't say who's wrong, but it's, 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 it's a certain time you have to play a distance, you know, so to encourage and run up on somebody that you ain't been dealing with from day one. I mean, even though he did go and visit his mother, he ain't hung out with dude like that daily. Now, it's been a long time because that, you know, he, I mean, what, Boosie got locked up. That was over 10 years ago now. So you ain't been seeing them together. Uh, you know, be honest with you, uh, Gotti hasn't been popping out like that. You'd have seen it because Boosie show everything. Uh, I, I don't, you know, I, I'm in Compton, and I keep with Compton business. Yeah, but, but allegedly, allegedly, at t barbershop talk about Big Juke losing his life was way closer than anybody would think. Wow. Wow. Yeah, but the thing is, OG, like, when you look at this, man, let's, let's be real, man. Like, Boosie, with all he got going on, should he even be dealing with any of this? 
shouldn't be dealing with none of it. You know, shouldn't be that. I, I, he, he ain't got a dog in none of them. He got his own problem. So to even be exposed with something like this, this is this, that this is fresh. I think it's an error in judgment. I don't know what he's trying to prove, you know. That's crazy, man. You know, it's crazy. An alliance with something like this, and you already got problems. So. Yeah. Well, Rollo also came out and said that Rollo Fam Goon said he going to kind of, he trying to stop, you know, going at Boosie. He said he for to stop jumping on here because I guess he's saying that, you know, this stuff ain't going to stop and he trolling him and he's saying pretty much, you know, it could, it could be, it could be, it could get bad. So he trying to figure out a way to pump the brakes now. He's like, man, let me just, cause, cause I'm going to be honest with you. Why is he trying to pump the brakes and he didn't call it out Boosie? Well, really, because I think they had some kind of behind the scene. A uh, little old conversation, but he had said that earlier today when I looked. He was like, uh, he gonna try to pump, but I don't think he, his 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 emotions is too funny. He just cried on 85 South about Dolph. That man hurt behind that Dolph stuff, man. So he'll say one thing, but your heart gonna say another, you know. Yeah, it's, it's some people uh, is really emotional about dead bodies. Yeah, know? yeah, that was his partner. So it's a, it, it, that ain't just like the TV a commercial come on. And people you didn't have relationships with. That's what when we talk about gang truce and 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 different gangs getting together. How you gonna get together with me and it's blood on your hands with friends of mine and I got blood on my hands with friends of yours. That's real. And we we gotta look at each other every day. It has to be a healing process. Wow. You know what I'm saying? OG OG, thank you, man. Hey, I just want. Hey, listen. There's blood on each on each party's hand. As OG just expressed a high B when it you know when it go down and 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 it's something that happens you know in the in the lifestyle that he's seen over the years. Uh, the thing is, uh, Wait is a I ain't seen nothing. I'm a, I'm a Christian. <laughs> okay, well, at things that he explained, allegedly. Well, he allegedly he just explained it <laughs> that 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 basically it can get tough when blood's been shed. And I agree with him. But get in the comments. Let us know, man. Have this thing. Went too far to repair when it comes down to Rollo and Boosie. And do y'all think Rollo's going to stop trolling Boosie uh, with all the situations that's popping out in the way that this internet's unfolding and he's having to be a part of it now? Do y'all see Rollo pulling, pumping the brakes? Rollo pretty much responds to Boosie and he says, hey man, you know, uh, you know, it's too soon for you to be popping out doing the stuff you're doing. Uh, Boosie also responded back and said that, hey, on Twitter, he said, my mom, you know, God to help my mom. Who do you agree with? Do you ride with Boosie or do you ride with Rollo? Let us know, man. Well, do, let's let's find out who rides with thinking young Gotti is getting ready to be indicted. Yo, God, oh, yeah, we'll talk about that, man. I'm going to bring you back on that, too. I got to talk to you about that here in a little bit, man. Check it, man. Boss Talk 101. Boss Talk 101. Boss Review talk. what a boss is talk. Man. <laughs> Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-He, the reason you see me.